Hi. Um, I played today uh, with operators in Bifrost and I think it could be a cool workflow and uh, I'd like to show how to do it. So first we need to export um, our geometry here as an Alembic cache. Just export it and uh, go to ABC. And I have it here already exported, so I don't do it twice. And we need to um, export the shader. I just hooked up some uh, textures here. And I'm going to export um, um, the material X utilities, export to material X, and then go to my folder here. I have already done this so. Yeah, that's all for now. So we have exported our geometry and the uh, material. Let me go File New. And I open up the Bifrost editor. So create a new graph. I don't need this input here. Then we go to Input the Alembic instance. We pass to our pillar file here. Bifrost ABC, pillar ABC open. So now we have this in here. And we create a cube. This is just our geometry that we see what we are doing in the viewport. And then we need an, a set instance geometry node. And here we hook in the instance geometry. And here we are using the preview geometry. And then we need some points to scatter for. Construct points. Then we need a value node. So first we need to set this to a uh, float 3, then we put it in, and this one has to be a fan in port. So now, bam, we are going to hide the cube, okay now we try to render this in the Arnold, okay first we need a light. Here we 300 maybe, I don't know. Now it has to load all the Arnold Bifrost plugins in the background. I hope it's working. What does the log say? I think it should work. Maya, are you coming back? Okay, yes. Here it is. So I stop it, try again, and now it's loaded to know. Oh, it's much faster. And here comes the operator thing. To apply the material, we need to create an Arnold operator operators. We are going to the material X one. Then, oh, come on. Where's my outline icon? We need to search in here for the operator. Yeah, here it is. Then. No, it's the wrong one. Rendering operators here. 
we're searching here for our material x file it's loaded and we have to, to use the look so now okay so, okay we have a have to use this as a selection here otherwise it can't pick up things now the shader is correctly loaded yes why why i do this all the time come on so and if we duplicate this here um, with input connections we get the second graph now we can scale this up rotate it yeah everything works like expected and because we are in bifrost world we can use something else here to create those points you can do all the other magic in bifrost to scatter those new pillars onto um, whatever you want so i think it could lead in some really great uh, workflows